hi gorgies welcome back to the channel i hope you guys are doing well you know the drill your mom your dad your brother your sister your uncle your aunt your niece your nephew your grandma your grandpa mm, mm, uh. i hope you guys are doing well i am doing great i'm feeling energized i am feeling super positive and i'm so excited because i know that we are well on our way to reaching that 1000 subscribers mark and we'll be giving away a 1000 rand woolworths voucher so if you haven't yet entered the giveaway do check out the video um it's my previous video i'll link it up here and i'll also leave the link in the description box and you can go check it out and enter if you'd like to stand a chance to win but anyway, if you are new to the channel, thank you so much for stumbling across this little family of ours. I really hope that you stay and you subscribe and you become part of this Goji family. If you're an OG Goji, then um, you already know, guys. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for the love. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I really, really, really do appreciate it. And yeah. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to comment down below if you have any questions on the products that I bought or if you have um, used the products before and they've treated you well and you just want to give a review, then feel free to do so as well. Let's get straight into the video. So this is the box that I have today. It's actually quite big. They were being very extra because I didn't buy that many things. Before I start, I just wanted to give you guys a bit of a background. Um, so these products that I'm going to be showing you here are for my natural hair. As you can see, I came here rocking my crown today because I've really been um, having it out. I'm at home. So I've been having it out a lot more and I've been like, you know, taking care of it a lot more. And just making sure that when I come out of this lockdown, I don't need to be all wigged up or weaved up. You know, I'm just there, you know queening in my crown it's really grown actually but i hardly ever stretch it so that's why people would not know that it's actually a bit longer because i don't stretch it out i do like it when it's in its um shrinkage state but anyway so my hair is low porosity and it's very important that when you're deciding on your hair care regimen that you actually know what porosity your hair is so basically hair porosity is your hair's ability to hold on to and absorb moisture so it is really 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 important that you know your um, porosity level before you actually start going to buy products um, that you're going to use for your hair regimen there are three levels of hair porosity there's low there's high and there's normal so you want to know where you stand um, in between those there are quite a few um, YouTube videos where they will show you how to test your hair's porosity so do check them out um, I'll also link some below um, just if it if you guys think it will help you i will definitely leave maybe like a video or two in the description box so do check it out and then you can do the test for yourself and see what kind of um hair porosity level you have like i said i have low porosity hair that means that my um strands sorry i'm also reading from my notes that means that my strands have a tightly bound cuticle layer that lays flat and tends to repel water so i find that most of the time with like my previous regimen i was putting on um these products and I found that my hair wasn't actually absorbing it and it just took a while my hair was feeling dry and not moisturized even though i was using super moisturizing products like i was the wash routine was great but after i washed my hair the products that i put onto the hair were the problem because then it would still leave my hair feeling dry and feeling brittle you know so i have decided to change that all up i am still using the same products in terms of washing the hair the difference now will be what i put onto the hair after washing it the one thing that you want to really focus on in terms of low porosity hair obviously is to watch um the products that you're using to wash your hair because you want them to be protein free if you have low porosity hair like me and then also it's very important that you use lighter oils and oils that can actually moisturize your hair and can actually help you to you know keep your hair looking healthy and happy so these oils are i'm going to list them here for you the good oils for low porosity hair are argan oil grapeseed oil jojoba oil boabab oil sweet almond oil pomegranate oil apricot oil sesame seed oil sunflower seed oil rose hip oil safflower oil camel seed oil and avocado oil 
so those are really great for um, all the ladies that have natural hair and the ladies that have low porosity hair like mine those are the oils that you would want to use on your hair enough about that I think that was the educational piece so now I take that information that I've just told you and look at the kind of products that I've actually purchased to see where everything kind of like comes in together so the first thing that I bought is the sheer moisture yucca and plantain anti breakage strengthening mask so this also has boobab oil which is something that I really do um, need because I don't have boobab oil in an actual oil so I'm getting it from all the products that I have purchased um, this is great with um, frizzy hair split ends and breaking hair so it helps to moisturize control boost shine hydrate your hair and it is sulfate free and color safe as well so I'm gonna be using this mask going forward instead of the mask that I had previously then I also went and bought Auntie Jackie's Fix My Hair um, this I always used to I have always loved this this is an intensive repairing um, conditioning mask this is going to be my second mask when I'm not using that one I've always loved this mask but I don't know why I stopped buying it because Auntie Jackie products were actually um, cert a few of them were actually doing very well for my hair but when I moved on to sheer moisture products I kind of let go of the Auntie Jackie side of things and I was only using like the butter for um, when I am um, doing my lock method so right now I am back to using fix my hair from auntie Jackie because I really actually do like how it feels on my hair next product is the sheer moisture boobab and tea tree oils low porosity protein free leave-in detangler so um this as you can see it's for low porosity hair and it's protein free it's a leave-in detangler one thing that i have um, noticed in my research though as well is that when you have low porosity hair it's better not to use leave-in conditioners as often as possible as often as everyone else so maybe like maybe once or twice a week we're using it leave-in conditioner or a leave-in milk rather so i did choose this um leave-in detangler and like when i detangle let's say once a week then i would use that in that case then i also got the sheer moisture manuka honey and mafura oil intensive hydration hair mask so this also has boobab oil this is great because of that I also really love this um, this mask it smells great and I was using it before I'm sure you guys would have seen it on the channel so this one is nothing new I'm just basically topping up what I have always used and then okay and then we have the um, sheer moisture manuka and honey manuka honey and mafura oil intensive hydration leave-in milk this also has boobab oil it is um it is good for hydrating your hair and styling dry and damaged hair so basically because mine is technically dry because it is low porosity doesn't absorb um moisture that easily i do like using hydrating milks and um yeah so this is a leave-in milk so it'll be great also to just um basically go back and forth between this one and the detangler and now we get into the oils so i did go ahead and buy um our sweet almond oil it was recommended as one of the oils that are really great for um low porosity hair it is quite a lightweight oil which is something that i think is why it was recommended so i'm gonna try this out i've never used it before um but yeah apparently you can also use it on your skin so i'm probably gonna try this on my skin as well and i'll let you guys know how it goes so that is the now solutions sweet almond oil it is a pure moisturizing oil and then i've also bought the old fave back this is the auntie jackie um grapeseed and avocado oil this helps to balance your hair porosity which is why it was working for me so well before 
because it is great for balancing out um, hair porosity. It says here that it is enriched with coconut, improves porosity level and moisture balance and it is an excellent pre-poo treatment. So I really, really, really love this because it has grapeseed oil as well as avocado oil. So I'm getting the best of both and these both of these are good for low porosity hair and I come back with my updated video on how these products have been treating me I will definitely let you guys know all the details and I will do the actual strand test and we can see where I where I am then versus where I am now last okay I bought two of the grapeseed oils that I just showed you last but definitely not least I am shooting a video tomorrow where I'm turning my the wig that I dyed um, chestnut blonde I'm gonna be turning it straight up blonde like I want a nice honey blonde that I used to have before before I cut it and now I still want that back so I am gonna try it out I bought more bleach this is just the volume this is the peroxide and then um, I've got the bleach I got so many of them they're actually in this package so stay tuned for all the hair color videos those will be back soon as well i'm super excited guys i'm excited because i just want you know long luscious honey blonde hair it's gonna be good but yeah for now i really am loving the texture of my hair i'm really loving how it's like i don't know i've only been using some of these products like literally for like, what three days because they all arrived around um, the same time I've been using it for about three days and I already have like such a big noticeable difference in the texture of my hair right now at this time my hair if I had left it out the whole day like this my hair right now would have been dry but it's still not dry it's like moisturized it doesn't feel brittle it feels soft and moisturized so i'm super 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 impressed i really 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 think these products are going to treat my hair well and i'm excited to share that journey with you guys as well i need a water break yo Alright, well guys that was basically it i just wanted to share with you guys this little unboxing and a little bit on my progress on my natural hair i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please don't forget to like comment and most importantly please don't forget to subscribe don't forget that we are running a giveaway so do make sure to check the description box i will be linking the video for the giveaway and you can go enter if you would like to stand a chance to win yourself a 1000 rand voucher from woolworths yeah i guess this is the end then guys um, I love you guys so so much. Thank you for your support and I'll see you in my next video ah. <laughs>